Assalamualaikum. My name is Nur Ayuni binti Suami. My metric number is AA191574. For chapter 1, Introduction. The subtopic that covered in this chapter is Project Background, Problem Statement, Adjective, Project Scope, and Project Significant. Project Background. To produce a high quality agriculture product, we need the machine that capable of maximizing the product lines. The second one is the main purpose of this project is to boost the production of the sugarcane seed. The third one is the cutting machine that use mechanism of automatic should be used to save user time and money. The last one is this project is to help the sugarcane industry to increase their production rate for the future purpose. As we can see here, we have two diagrams that show the first one is the sugarcane harvest data from 2016 to 2018. We can see that sugarcane production for each year increasing. The next one is the diagram of sugarcane production graph from 2007 to 2018. We can see that in 2010, the production of sugarcane the highest. Problem statement. The problem that we can see from this project is by using the traditional method, they cannot cut sugarcane in large quantity, high wage costs to pay employee salaries and use a lot of time for one secular process. Even though the productivity of sugarcane product is not too widespread around, but the product still needed to producing the sugarcane fastly and reduce the time of cutting process, especially for urgent use. The next one is objective. For the first one is invest investigate the exciting sugarcane cutter hand machine process. The second one is design and simulate the sugarcane cutter machine with the requirement that needed. The third one is develop improvement that will benefit small scale local sugarcane farmer in such a number of different ways. The next one is project scope. For the first one is, our project is focused on the sugarcane cutting process. And the next one is, this product resulted from the research on the new cutting machine that is available on the market. The third one is, from the latter machine, they are only able to cut the sugarcane per one time. This kind of waiting, manpower and time is mean one time or secular process they can just cut one piece of sugarcane. The fourth one is the main motivate in our mission is to cut the sugarcane without wasting a lot of manpower and time. The last one is in the fabricate process we are using software like SOLIDWORKS to, so to observe the function and advantages of our mission and avoid error when producing the prototype. For project significant the first one is cutting the sugar cane without wasting too much manpower. That means when you use the machine from, from before, you can see the manpower that needed is one tool, one person. And maybe one to three person for traditional method. But for the machine, we just need one person only just to handle the machine on and off button. And the second one is reduce the dur duration during cutting process. The third one is the total of sugar can input a lot more compared to all machine. The fourth one is there is packaging process inside the machine. And the last one is user friendly. I will present for chapter two literature review. These are some of the sugarcane cutting method that are already on market. The first method is the method using traditional tools. This method uses hundred percent manpower for each cutting and packaging process. The second one is sugarcane cutter half and automatic machine. 
This machine is a modern machine that can reduce the use of manpower. However, the market selling price of this machine is a major disadvantage. And the last one is sugarcane cutter hand tools. This machine is also a modern machine, yet it still uses a lot of manpower and can have a negative impact on the health of user. Next, I will explain the machine strength and limitation parts. For the semi-automatic machine, the number of limitation of this machine is more than its advantage. This is because this machine still uses a lot of manpower, uncomfortable to use because the user need to stand for a long time, can cause a server back pain, and only used by small industry. For the next machine is a fully automatic machine. This machine has many advantage. However, the most notable limitation in the is the price. This is because not many small scale farmer can afford to purchase price and its maintenance. The last one is the sugarcane cutter hand tools. This machine is a machine that requires hu human movement. This machine also has its own limitation. Among the limitation is that it can have detrimental effect on the user's spine. This is because the weight of this machine is very heavy. These are pros and cons that we discover as a result of our research. The comparison in sugarcane input, the old version can cut one stick per process and the new version can cut two or more stick per process. The comparison in sugarcane cutting duration, the old version take a long time and the new version can short the cutting process. The comparison in manpower, the old version use much more manpower compared to the new version. And the comparison in total revenue of cutting cane, the old version, the average quantity of sugar cane cut within a week is unsatisfactory. And the new version for average quantity of sugar cane that cut within a week can give reasonable results. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Muhammad Zarfan Mirostam. My metric number is AA191545 and then this is our rough feature of our methodology. First is flowchart and then design specification, initial design sketch, material selection, machine and tools and lastly estimation of cost. This is our project flowchart. Okay, we start off with meeting our SV and then start uh, researching about the background of project, objective and project scope and then distribute assignment and then do some research or uh, about data sugarcane and the latest that sugarcane machine and then we fabricate some sketch uh, and then choose the most appropriate sketch uh, drawing that meet all of our criteria to draw it using solid work and then we carry out the project idea develop uh, project idea to make analysis and survey we do some analysis project and then final report next is a presentation with panels and then report submission next is design specification this is some of the criteria of our ECC machine first is workability we hope that the machine we are designing can reduce the time taken uh, for cutting the sugarcane. In previous or traditional ways, they only can cut uh, sugarcane uh, one per time. So we hope that uh, our machine can cut multiple sugarcane in one time. So next is safety. We assure that our machine have details of protection to increase the safety factor of the tools. Next is size. We hope that our machine or not too small, so that uh, we can have the surf, the work surface to put the packaging pack. Next is cleanliness. We hope that the machine that we are designing can be clean enough, or can be easy to be clean, not rusty when get clean or once a week. 
Next, we go to the sum of the initial design of sketches. Uh, we can see the first sketches, second sketches, and then the third sketches. In these old sketches, we use a lot of uh, rolling method or using the sugarcane, uh, moving the sugarcane towards the cutting blade. We find out that this uh, mechanism uh, use a lot of intricate parts and then it will consume a lot of money. Next, we go to the metal selection. We can see we use some aluminium because it is uh, rust proof and then we use pneumatic cylinder for our slim, uh, cutting motion. Next, we use some um, nice steel for structure, uh, both and nut. Our connection, uh, saw blade for the cutting blade and compressor for three parts, and then this is some machine and tools that uh, we use if we fabricate the machine. First, we have steel five sets, vinyl caliper, uh, angle grinder, drilling machine, and then MIG welding machine. This is our estimation for our product as you can see an alloy and then pneumatic cylinder my silver and the total amount is 951 ringgit this is our final design sketch uh, after we go to our all of our uh, last uh, three sketches we find out that this most suitable um, design mechanism that we can uh, that is cheaper is using gravitational pull where we put the sugar cane on top of uh, a slide and then the slide will using gravitational pull will uh, move the sugar cane uh, into a stopper then a cutting plate will cut the sugar cane and then the sugar cane will fall down to the top. Next uh, is our expert result. We hope that the ECC able to cut multiple quantity than than before it short uh, and in a short time. ECC can manage the power while the sugar cane is cutting process, and then ECC become one of the tools that may help the Malaysia agricultural sector. Next, we go to the result and discussion. This is solid work drawing of our full assembly product. We can see the blue part is our slider and stopper where the sugar can be slide and then will be stopped by stopper and then the red uh, pneumatic cylinder will cut the sugar cane uh, in three feet uh, out in three feet then fall down into a basket which uh, is located in the uh, yellow platform. This is our exploded view for the machine. The compressor and our uh, electronic uh, box is actually for cosmetic purposes, but uh, in real life, it may be uh, different for our sketch from our sketch. This is uh, the project result. Uh, we have mass of five hundred and thirty-one kilogram uh, length. Uh, or height is 170 centimeter, weight is 80 centimeter, and long is 169 centimeter. Next, we will talk about the height problem of our machine. We know that the height is around 170 centimeter, but it is not suitable for our Malaysian consumer. We have height around. 140 until 160 centimeter. So we have designed the. We have made a cal uh, calculation about the height of the actual sugar platform that we will put it, which is the slide. So uh, the height of the slide is around 147 centimeter. This is suitable enough for our machine because. We have made a calculation, uh, calculation about the height of 
slider if we uh, build or fabricate the slider lower than 140 uh, cm our stiffness uh, of slide will not is not high enough for the uh, sugarcane to move or to have the gravitational effects on the sugarcane so this sugarcane will not slide smoothly or smoothly towards the stopper so the cutting mechanism will not work next we talk about the project result this is the top view and the side view we can see the greyish uh, part is actually our protective cover next is uh, the far view this is our switch box and then the stopper and then packaging place which is the yellow plate and then cutting parts cover next i will show you on the system that we apply to our machine our ecc machine so this is the machine where we that we are using the rotary directional valve or valve work uh, that is this is a pneumatic device uh, or pneumatic uh, system as you can see in the picture we can always uh, adjust our speed using the button and then that is how our pneumatic cylinder uh, retract and cutting work so that's all for me thank you consider to use product the first one is ready with three to four pieces of sugar can at the entering of the slide get ready with hanging the set at the packaging place the second one is push green button at the switch box to switch on the machine the next one is let the sugar cane going down through the slide to the cutting tool. After that, sugar cane will enter the sack. Then, wait until all part of sugar cane be cut and enter the packaging pack. The next one is push red button to off the machine. The last one is tie the sack with rope when already 10 kg of sugar cane inside it. The period before and after time taken before is 1 minute per sugarcane after 0 0.5 minute per sugarcane. Difference period before and after use ACC is 1 minute minus with 0 0.5 minute we got 0 0.5 minute. So percent of period different before and after use ACC is 50%. Analysis of Productivity We assume that 1 hour is equal to 60 minutes. 1 sugar cane before we take 1 minute. 1 sugar cane after 0 0.5 minute and 1 sugar cane's mass is 2 kg. And for 10 kg sugar cane, we need 5 sugar cane and 5 minute for before. So we use the pro formula of productivity equal to output per input packet per hours before is 12 packets packet per hours after is 20 packet per hours so percent of productivity is 100 percent increasing i will show the video of animation for cutting mechanism for electric can cutter ecc the conclusion in general, we have accomplished all of our objectives. Aside from that, the project was complete effectively and was able to assist small-scale local sugarcane farmers in Malaysia. It is believed that advantage of this machine will attract farmers such as the potential to save money, times for cutting and packaging. These are some suggestions for improvement. The installation of tires at the engine legs for instance. This is to make the machine move easier. The sack hook come next. This is because the hook 
can use to hanging the sack back in packaging process. The final step is to expand the machine wide. This is significant since the weight of this EEC machine can affect the sugar cane intake. As a result, we anticipate being able to improve this machine in the future. Thank you.